Tesla might be in some serious trouble. There was a fatal crash involving full self-driving supervised, which has triggered an NHTSA investigation. And the crash was with a pedestrian. The investigation is specifically looking into full self-driving's ability to operate in conditions of reduced visibility, like rain, sun glare, that kind of stuff. And here's the kicker. It covers every Model S and X since 2016, every Model 3 since 2017, every Model Y since 2020, and every Cybertruck ever made. That is millions of vehicles. In addition to the fatal crash with the pedestrian, they're also investigating other crashes that led to severe injury. I feel like people who don't own Teslas and aren't interested in full self-driving shouldn't be forced to participate in this like national beta test that's hurting people. And the main reason these problems are happening at all is because of a cost-cutting measure that Tesla did to remove all of the ultrasonic sensors from all of their cars and rely instead on just Tesla Vision, which is just cameras. Those ultrasonic sensors help Tesla see in conditions of, you guessed it, reduced visibility, which is now where they're having accidents. And full self-driving on the Cybertruck has been riddled with problems like veering people into oncoming traffic and running red lights, curbing tires and taking the wrong exit on interstates, like other drivers should not be subjected to that. That's terrifying.